Yeah, I think it's important security is part of the top 10 because if you look at over the last decade, the increasing uh, cost to our nuclear plants, 30% of it has been or, uh, originated from the security programs and processes that we've put in place. Now, many of it clearly needed based on uh, the events of 9-11-2001. Bring it up! Delivering the nuclear promise is really um, to address three things. You know, nuclear technology, when it was built, and many of us weren't around when it was built, but yet we have the obligation and responsibility to run it safely. When it was built, it was constructed with three focus areas. One, safe, reliable, cost-efficient electricity. And clearly our industry has delivered on two of those three. We have a very, very high level of safety and a very outstanding record of reliability. Therefore, we've got work to do around our economics. What we want the workers to understand is everything that we're talking about in delivering nuclear promise has to do with productivity, proficiency of changes, uh, reducing some of the burden that we've placed on ourselves to allow our workers to work equally as safe to the same levels of high standards that we've always expected. None of the initiatives around delivering the nuclear promise are focused on reducing standards of excellence. They're all about improving the efficiency, improving the productivity, optimizing our oversight that we have across our nuclear plants, but we all expect our plants to operate with that same high level of reliability and safety that we've always enjoyed. I think success for us will look like this uh, culture of innovation at our nuclear sites that are always looking for improved ways to do things at our sites more efficiently, more productive, and with even less cost than they currently exist today. So while we have a number of initiatives under delivering nuclear promise underway, I think success for us is this culture of continuous optimization of our nuclear plants to make sure, again, running at the same levels of reliability, high levels of excellence, operational excellence, and constantly looking at ways to do things more cost effective. I'm personally passionate about delivering the nuclear promise because, again, I think we have outstanding men and women that run our nuclear power plants. Our nuclear power plants aren't recognized right now in the current market structures for the value that they provide this nation around clean, carbon-free energy, always on, fuel's always there, very, very reliable, high levels of safety, and just many, many other aspects that uh, other power plants don't provide this nation. So my focus is to make sure that we create an environment where these nuclear assets are recognized for all of that value, and it keeps our employees gainfully employed in the communities that they serve, and the opportunities to continue to provide this nation with clean, carbon-free energy.